Hello, I am doing a second video in a row on the Viotti Concerto because um, yesterday I played through it and I hadn't really practiced the um, recapitulation, the last page in a long time and uh, I wanted to improve on that <laughs> so that then um, it's basically uh, ready to be practiced as a whole, perhaps with uh, a play along CD also. Okay, so there are um, a number of uh, additional challenges compared to the exhibition. Uh, particularly at some part that is, has been in A major <laughs> the first time around is now in A minor and that means um, this big stretch for um, the minor interval from uh, A fourth finger to C uh, second finger on the A string rather than C sharp which is easier. So um, I have um, looked at my music <laughs> and there are a number of uh, places where I can actually uh, switch to second position. So then it's easier with um, uh, one and, uh, and three to play the minor third, but it's not at every spot. So particularly the one, um, this one, stretch but it has to be played in first position because of the first finger E that's also <laughs> in that. Okay, so, I mean, I just have um, a terrible hand position with this one, <laughs> but it seems to be the only way I can actually reach. only is it a stretch but also the fourth finger needs to clear the A string. <laughs> <laughs> easily <laughs> also I'm feeling the stretch so um, how can this be made easier um, one way to approach it is uh, yeah to this Alexander technique to not 
not concentrate on the difficulty, but uh, on ways to avoid unnecessary tension by constructive thinking and also yeah, giving the body opportunity to figure things out. And uh, one hint I might give is um, bring the elbow more under. So, okay. So I'm playing this from the beginning and uh, then let's see what else there is to practice. that from also playing this or having played that before that uh, by this time I'm already pretty tired <laughs> I mean when I get to that part and um, it is the same now because it's the end of my practice session and um, I'm also very tired and that uh, means um, that I have tension in my bow arm and the sound is not so good. So there's lots of uh, scratching, scratchiness. Um, okay, so the first time with these uh, was uh, pretty well in tune. I mean, I listened back, but it seemed to me while I played it, it was well in tune right from the beginning. And uh, the second time it uh, took some time, so I didn't really set up my hand uh, right from the beginning. Okay, so then, um, yeah, there are these um, thirds, sequence of thirds. similar in the development section um, no actually in the exposition And 
that case, uh, the, the first part is more difficult, and then going down is uh, easier because then I don't have these uh, minor third stretches between <laughs> two and four again that I have here. Okay, so let's see. So I will apply what my teacher told me to do in the beginning, namely um, uh, put a slight accent to the second of the slurred notes, like a syncopation, like surprises me. playing them strictly in rhythm <laughs> and taking the luxury of stretching the time when I need it technically. <laughs> That for today. Talk to you soon. Bye for now.